Blank sent you a request for $20. I bought you drinks and we didn't hook up. Hey, what's going on guys? This is Marky and today I'm going to be reading r slash choosing beggars. Hey man, I just want to confirm, Blue touches base with you and paid for my seat on the tailgate bus to next weekend's something game? I'm sorry, I don't have your number saved. Who is this? This is Blue! Blue's friend! We met at the open house she held in July. She told me you had a, you know, open spot to the party bus and that she had already paid for a friend who backed out so I could slide in. Is that cool? Oh, hey Blue. Yeah, I remember you. I haven't heard from Blue, but she did pay for two spots, so let me check in with her. Okay man, cool, you're in. We're leaving at 7am from Blue, main campus. There's plenty of free street parking near there, so you can leave your car all day while we're at the game. Dude, 7am? Why so early? I hate getting up early. Also, I don't drive. Is it possible to pick me up later on your way to the game? I doubt it, but where do you live? Blue Street. On the west side near the airport? Not? Question mark? I'm sorry, but that is the exact opposite direction we'll be going. I talked to Blue, and she told me she told you the time when she offered to give you the second spot she paid for for free. Plus, I know the game isn't until 1, but we'd like to get there by 8.30 or 9 to tailgate and enjoy the day. Hopefully you can make it. Come on, don't be a douche. Just pick me up. I have a condition that makes it hard to get up early. It's hard on me. Is that condition called unemployment? But um, tss. Listen, Blue has been kind enough to give you her extra spot on the bus and extra game ticket too, from what I understand. But it's still my limo bus for the day, I'm afraid. You're gonna have to be there at seven or be left behind. You know what, dude? Frick off. People have a hard time with different things in this life. I was really looking forward to the game and taking a break from my stress. Now, you're making it worse. What? What the frick? Blue just called me and told me that you weren't comfortable with me going, so now I can't. Thanks for ruining my weekend, asshole. You're right. And here's what I know. I talked to Blue, and you are no longer invited. I found someone else to pay for her seat on the limo bus and ticket. Enjoy the 90 minute hitchhike ride, you waste of space. Hope you get to sleep in. <laughs> oh, hush. Yeah, I don't understand people like this. How can you just butt in like that and expect to be treated fairly if you're gonna be an asshole? What's wrong with people? My brother, the most entitled jerk I've ever met in my life. The I'm telling mum part killed me. I'm 25 and he's 23 for reference. I called my mom right away and told her about this, and she just laughed and said that he's an idiot for not taking the deal. Hey, can I buy your old Apple Watch? I was thinking $20. How about this? You help me move my room around a bit, and I'll give you it. I just wanted to move the bed to the other side of the room, the mirror, and one of the dresses. Really shouldn't take more than 30 minutes since I'm helping you. What the frick? No! Why can't Love Heart Face help you? He can. I'm just offering for you to do it so I don't have to pay any money for it. 20 bucks? Take it or leave it. Lol. Okay, I'll leave it. That's manual labor. Moving labor generally costs $100 an hour. 30 minutes of labor is 50 bucks. That watch isn't worth 50 bucks. What? I'm helping you. So if you want to get your freaking technical, that brings it to $25 according to your crappy calculations, which aren't even valid because one, it's not moving labor. We are literally just moving three things across the room. And two, the watch is a series three with cellular. So it's worth way bloody more than 50 bucks anyways. No, frick that, I'm not doing any manual labor. You got it for free anyways, so you just give it to me. I'm telling mom. <laughs> Tell her! Dude, how do people like this even exist? <laughs> yeah, I need exposure, but not this way. Also, I think the amount of emojis he used is scary. Hello, could I post your song on my profile? I think it is very good, and I think it will fetch a lot of attention for me and you. Uh, okay. I don't know if you really do just tag me or something. All right, love that, love that. I will post it immediately up for a small fee. USD $10, very cheap. 
Once you send the money, I will immediately post it on my profile so you'll get lots of viewers. <gasps> shock face, shock face. Lol, what? You only have bloody 2k followers. Plus, I'm not gonna pay someone to post my own song. It's okay, sir. Even I only have 2k followers. You were still able to get views. Quick, send money now for easy deal. Dude, no, I'm not gonna pay you. You missing out? I need content to support my profile and you need advertisement. I said no. <laughs> you thinker I care? So what if you don't pay? I still can post your song for myself. <laughs> you should have asked for a discount. Mab, yeah, I would have let you, lol. Okay, man, I'll just block you, I guess. Also, if you do post the song without permission, I legally can sue you, go ahead. Lol stupid, lol stupid, lol stupid, lol stupid. Is this available? Address please? Yes, I'm in Aylmer. Okay, I can't go there just for a microwave unless you pay me 25 bucks for gas. Um, I don't even know how to respond to you. Unreal. This is for a free LG microwave. But <laughs> seriously? Who pays 25 bucks for someone else to come pick it up to take it off their hands? Are you, are you stupid? Girls, how do you solve the case like this? I listed something with 35 euros. She bargains 25 euros and I accepted. When she picked it up, she gave me 20 euros. I asked her if she can transfer me 5 euros per PayPal or bank, but she refused. She said 20 euros, it's all she has. Then, she begged me to sell it with 20 euros. It's so awkward moment, and I don't want someone beg me in front of door, so I sold it. I feel so uncomfortable, I have feeling betrayed even it's small money. Not type of stingy, always help homeless and penniless, but this case I'm really mad. Yeah, I'd be really mad too if someone ripped me off 15 euros. That's a lot of Australian dollars. Draw my OC please, no charge please. Don't be greedy. Oh shit, here we go again. Can you please draw me? You're so good. I don't take requests. Once or if I open up commissions and set some prices I might, love heart. What do you mean prices? Why can't you do it free? Art is a hobby. You don't need money to draw it for me. A single realistic portrait can take me four plus hours to draw, color, and create. Art takes time. Also, supplies cost money. I draw everything by hand traditionally, and supplies will eventually run out. Then do your digital art so you don't have to run out of supplies. I can shout you out on my page. I have 117 followers, and I will credit you. I don't own a drawing tablet, nor do I have much experience with digital art. Besides, what about the time that I'm taking to draw and work for you? You wouldn't want to do a job for someone else for free, would you? Other artists take less than four hours to do what you do. Don't lie. Art is easy. And if it's really something you love, then you can create for your fans. Why are all you artists so greedy nowadays? I offered a shout out. Please just draw me it. It's not that hard. And an artist isn't a job. Working at an office or store is. You live a sad life. You just do art for a living. What happens to the non-greedy artist who painted to inspire instead of paint for a check? I hate artists like you. Please just draw me for free or I will show the world how greed you are. Exposure will bring people to you. You will get more fans and be more famous. <laughs> then go to the other artists. Or you can draw yourself and if you think it's so easy, kindly stop wasting my time. Also, art is a job. Look at books, posters, anything with a design. That was art that was printed to something, and those people got paid for their work. You can gladly screen cap and share these messages if you feel the need to do so. I don't believe any artist should ever work for free. No one should work for free. I don't care about the fame and exposure. I care to be able to take care of myself and my family. Have a nice day. <laughs> you're a greedy binge. I hope you die, you're so rude. People like this exist? This is real? Surely they're pretending. Look at Mozart, man. He was a pretty cool guy. I'm sure he got paid for his work. Mac is Monopoly. Hi, Black. How much are you hoping to pick up a Piccadilly for? Just bought a new car, so I don't need the Suzuki. 
The max I can offer is 50 to 100 dollars. Whatever you think is fair, question mark. I'm having my first baby in April next year, and a new car would be great. It'd be sister grade. Congrats! Car's worth $25,000, so couldn't do that. Good luck finding the other ticket, though. Thank you. How much are you asking for it so I can get a rough ballpark? Funny you should ask, mate. I've had people offer five grand. <laughs> Thanks anyways. It was a nice way you found a loophole to make money. Keep up the good work. I let you know that I'm expecting a child next year, and you thought it's a good opportunity to try and ask me for more than $5,000 for something you got for free. I could redeem the car and sell it for 20 grand. Save your money and spend it on the kid. You worthless mm, fun knuckle, you, you frick, you fricker. Hate you. And our last one. My brother is unemployed and my boyfriend wanted to help him out. We live in a place where minimum wage is $7.25 an hour, and my brother only has a high school degree and not a lot of work experience. Yet he thinks his time is worth at least $20 an hour, despite never having a job that paid more than $10 an hour. He goes, Hey, this is Black Boyfriend. Still looking for work? Yeah, man, I am. I have a secretary position in my firm open. It's 30 hours a week and pay is $17 an hour, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 7 to 5. 17 an hour? That's it? Yeah, dot dot dot. That ain't crap. I'm gonna need more than that. I want at least $20 an hour. I'm not getting nickel dimed again. Well, that's the pay for this position. Let me know if you change your mind. Lamal, I'm not gonna change my mind. I don't want to be a secretary anyway. That's for women. <laughs> what? Why? Why? Did, how did he go there? This is like, um, r slash a boomer humor. He's just like, Urgh, pay low, women bad, grr, this women job, urgh. <laughs> Seriously? Well, howdy y'all, that's all I have time for today. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, there's also more links for more cool stuff in the description down there. And I just hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!